Uh, what we're going to do here is um, make some pickled fish. The, uh, a lot of people fish northerns and they cut out the Y bones and they throw them away. Well, if we pickle them, these Y bones all dissolve and you have some pickled fish. So what we got to do is, is all this fish, we got four pounds. We got to cut it up into one inch chunks and then uh, add a couple things and leave it for a week and then we switch it out into the new solution. So there we got our four pounds of uh, northern pike fish cut up. It's uh, mostly all Y bones, the meat. So we got it all chunked up into one inch chunks. Now we got to add uh, 5 eighths cups of pickling salt. And if that isn't enough, with the fish that we have, we'll have to add more, make another batch of that. Okay, looks like it's mixed up pretty good, so now we're going to just start adding our fish. Hopefully all this fits in a gallon jar. Alright, what I did is I made another little half a batch of the brine. I used another cup of vinegar and a little over a quarter cup of uh, canning and pickling salt to make a little bit more brine for this. I'm going to dump it in there. There, now you just refrigerate for seven days. Every day you got to take it out and shake it and stir it up a little bit. Then on the seventh day, we empty the brine out and start a whole new thing. So basically what we did was a week ago, we um, took the fish, cut the uh, Y bones and stuff up into uh, one inch pieces and made a brine with uh, vinegar and pickling salt and put it in here for seven days. It's been seven days now. We're going to take it out. We're going to strain the fish and we're going to make our a new brine and pack them into the jars and then we'll have pickled fish in seven days. We're going to strain the fish and uh, rinse it real good uh, in the sink here. It's about four pounds of fish do it three and a half, four pounds. Uh, we're going to rinse the fish real good with fresh water and rinse the jug out. You can put it back into this jug or you can put it in smaller jars. We're going to put it in smaller jars. Uh, we're going to make our brine now for the, uh, the fish after it's been rinsed really well. Uh, you've got to have uh, one and a half uh, quarts of vinegar. Okay, we put one and a half uh, quarts of vinegar in the pot. Now we got to have four cups of white wine. Cooking wine cooking wine. Four cups of white cooking wine. This is not a prescription. This is 
Okay, now we've got to put two cups of sugar in, uh, put it in there and let it dissolve so you can't see it. Okay, now we got to put one tablespoon of pickling spices in with the uh, the mixture. And we're going to pack the jars now with the fish. We're going to put some fish in, in the bottom of the jar. That, and we're going to throw a few onion rings in. Like so. And we'll put some more fish in. So on and so forth till the, uh, the jars are full. Alright, we got our fish and our onions in the jars. And now we're ready to put the brine on it. Uh, once the brine's on it, we'll seal them up. And they'll set for another seven days and they'll be ready to eat. Okay, there's our uh, pickled northern pike, just from the Y bones, the Y bone meat. Uh, we'll put it in the refrigerator for seven days, seven days, you're ready to eat.